do it in the Lord and Doc said, yeah, you're ready. You can go now. But he forgot to release the hook. The light was still red and I couldn't pull away. So now I had to go call, I had to go on Google Maps and and tap uh, tap the name of the truck terminal. And it led me to the phone number for the guard shot instantly. So now I just saved my own ass. I actually, I couldn't even come out here. I couldn't come out here. The car, the loading, the, what do you call it? The fart of the driver, when he came out and said it was okay, it was not, a, oh shit, I almost touched the train. Look at this. Damn, look at the gap space. About a quarter inch. Oh, mess. I pull up too close. What is this, feed? Some kind of, yeah, this thing must be heavy. Oh, there goes the seal. I don't, don't want to go too far with this because I don't want nobody to sneak up on it. Yeah, like I was saying, he forgot. It seemed like he told me it was okay to pull away and leave. But he went away and left me with the hooks, the hook on a bumper. You know that thing that goes over? Yeah. So the light was still red. So now I had to go squeeze my head between the other guy's trailer. I had to put my skull right between the other guy's trailer and the pad, the padding for the loading dock. And then he didn't show up. Well, so then you know that's when I went on the, I went on my cell phone, went on Google Maps, tapped the location. The location gave me the phone number, and it led to the guard shack. So now I told the guard shack lady to. The guy said it was okay to leave, but he didn't release a hook. So, I'm not too sure, but this is my first time coming here. This is my first time coming here, so I'm gonna just leave this. I'm not gonna put no cable on, no, no seal on it yet. I'm gonna pull up in the garage shack first. So, what I had to do, when I heard him coming back, and I saw the other guy's trailer bouncing up and down, with a fart left inside there. So now I said, all right, let me run. So I started running all the way back to the, I started running all the way back to the, the end of the other guy's trailer, right? I run it, ran all the way to the back of his trailer and right next to mine. And I had to squeeze my arm right, I had to push the padding aside and squeeze my head right up against his trailer and the padding and stick my arm in there and say, yeah, hey, yo, yo, yo. You forgot to release the hook. And he goes, oh shit. He said, my bad. And then he goes, bam. So he hits the button and I'm, and I'm out of here. Anyway, I'm gonna just do a little partial video. I ain't gonna go too far with this. By the way, this ain't the Volvo. I'm in um, Toledo, Ohio. I'm in Toledo, Ohio. So I'm picking up this low. Oh, this is... um. This is about the end of the week. This is near the end of the week. Today is Thursday. My dispatcher says he's not going to be here tomorrow. I mean, he's not going to be available tomorrow. He's not, see, I'm not driving a Volvo. I'm driving a white Kenworth. So, he said, um, my boss would have to give me a load. So, my boss also said he's not going to be here tomorrow. So I texted my boss and said, yes, I could sure use a break anyway. So it looked like I'm going to have tomorrow off. I'm going to have Saturday and Sunday off again, just like I usually do. All right. I'm crossing the railroad track now. All right, by the time I reach that gate, I got to cut it. I got to cut the cell phone because it might, oh, shit. I didn't realize it. I guess I'm coming through the same side. I even backed into the dock with a tandem slid all the way forward. Oh shit. Whoa, I'm after it. I don't want to go over them tracks too fast. Alright, 
since I can't have a jackknife far the way. I'm gonna have to do a, I mean, I can't turn all the way. I'm gonna have to jackknife this truck and then bend myself up in there. come over here I want to clear them railroad tracks first I'm gonna have to stick the truck out the gate all right that should do it all right that's it y'all gotta cut this thing I gotta get the bills and I gotta I gotta ask permission if I should seal it or let them look inside. See y'all later.